Hey y'all, it's Rosie and in this video, I'm going to show you how I make my version of Southern style potato salad. I'm going to start off with some russet potatoes that I'm going to rinse and scrub under cool water. And once I'm done doing that, I'm going to place my potatoes into a large pot. I'm going to leave my potatoes whole as you can see. And now I'm going to start pouring in some cool water. I want to add just enough water to cover up my potatoes. And then I'm going to boil these potatoes over high heat until they are nice and fork tender. Once my potatoes are done, I'm going to drain the water and I'm going to let these sit until they're cool enough for me to handle because I will peel those using my hands. And while the potatoes are cooling down, I'm going to chop up some onion. For my potato salad, I really like green onion. I use the green parts and the white parts. If you're not a fan of green onion, you can use yellow or white. I'm also going to be using some celery, and FYI, I did rinse and wash my celery and onion before I chopped them up. So I'm going to chop this up nice and fine, and now I'm going to peel my potatoes using my hands. So once the potatoes are nice and peeled, I'm going to grab a knife and I'm just going to cut my potatoes. Some people like their potato salad mushy, some people like it chunkier. If you like it mushy, mush your potatoes up. If you like it chunky, you can leave it just like I have mine. While my potatoes boiled, I actually boiled up a few eggs and these are them. I'm just going to crumble them up using my whisk there. And once I'm done crumbling up the eggs, I'm going to add the eggs into the bowl along with my potatoes. So followed by the eggs, I'm going to start adding in my green onion. And don't forget if you're not a fan of green onion, you can use a yellow onion or white. And I also added in my celery. At this time, I'm going to start sprinkling in my seasonings. I have some pepper, I'm using black pepper, some salt, garlic pepper, and not garlic pepper, but garlic powder and onion powder. And that is enough seasoning for me. Season it to your taste. And after I'm done seasoning this up, I'm going to make my dressing for my potato salad. So you'll need some mayonnaise. I'm using Best Foods, aka Hellman's. And you're also going to need some mustard. I'm using regular yellow mustard. Followed by the mustard, I'm going to add in some dill relish. And I will also be using sweet relish as well. If you want to just use one of the two, you certainly can do so. Just double it. And now I'm going to add in some pickle juice. That's my little secret recipe or my secret ingredient. And now once everything's in there, I'm going to mix it until it's well combined. Don't forget if you want the exact measurements, visit my blog iHeartRecipes.com. If you're watching this on YouTube, there will be a clickable link down in the description box. And now we're going to add our dressing with the other ingredients. So once it's in there, fold the ingredients. Be sure not to, you know, over mix otherwise it will be really mushy. But if you like it mushy, hey, that's your thing. You know, do you. And once everything is nicely mixed, I'm just going to place this in the refrigerator until it's nice and cool. And now I'm going to just dish it out in my serving dish. And that's really it. Really delicious. Simple to make. Really easy. Again, the recipe can be found on my blog, iHeartRecipes.com. And to finish this off, I'm just going to add some color by sprinkling on some paprika. If you're on Instagram, be sure to follow me and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.